Clan from Hamster Clan. And this video will be about water bottles versus water bowls. So, um, well, to get started, let's talk about water bottles. So, water bottles, so let's start with the cons of water bottles. So, water bottles, a lot, the hamster isn't in a natural position when it's drinking. And bacteria does tend to grow a lot faster, and I mean a lot faster than it would in a water bowl. And it can cause a lot of people to forget because they sim because because you don't because m more water can be stored and things like that and um more water can be stored and because it's not gonna get dirty like bedding isn't gonna get into it a lot of people just end up forgetting but the bacteria does grow and the water will end eventually another problem is that a lot a, there's no risk of hamsters falling in the water and there's no risk of or and Actually, no, that's a pro. Sorry, 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 sorry. Anyways, um, I'm not a con is that if the hem, if is that, let me breathe. Okay, good. Okay, a pro is that if the water gets blocked, not, it's not, oh, the hamster could be without water for a long time. Okay, now let's get into the cons of water bowls. But before that, I'm just going to tell you that wa the only problem with water bowls is that they, I mean, not the only problem with water bowls, is that with water bowls, it's not just, you're not just going to get a old water, uh, an old water, an old food dish and use it. A lot of food dishes are too high and the hamster can't really drink from it. So you can use the plate that I have here and it works great. Okay, so now let's get into the cons. So the water can get dirty a lot easier, which, um, yeah, the water can get dirty a lot, lot easier because bedding can get into a pee, poop, you know, all that stuff. However, if you put it in a high place, that's completely fixed. The water can evaporate, um, which is if you live in a hot country, you may want to get a water bottle because then the water will stay inside the water and it can't evaporate. Um, there's a risk of the hamster falling into the water, but if you have a water bowl like the one I have here, nothing bad is going to happen because it's just a, because it's too shallow. The max of the paws is going to get a little bit wet and maybe a little bit of fur in its belly, but it's not too bad. But if you have a, a much less shallow one, then yes, the, the hamster could get dangerously wet. Um, and they do take up more space. However, I have a pretty bulky water bottles so it basically takes the same amount of space once i hang it up okay so now let's get into the pros of a of a water bottle okay so they can't get dirty unlike the water bowl um the water doesn't evaporate how i said before there's no risk of the hams are falling into water and yeah that's it um I'm not, and okay so now uh, let's get into the next. So now, now let's get into the pros of a water bowl. So the pros: the hamster is drinking it from a natural position. It's great for aquariums, and it's a lot easier to change slash clean. So basically, um, because basically think of a water bottle being a human water bottle, and think of the water bowl being a cup it's a lot easier to clean a cup when you're washing dishes than to clean a human water bottle and if you ever clean dishes or if you ever even try to clean a water bottle you know that's kind of a pain sometimes for some designs yes for some designs not as much um so uh yeah that's pretty much it and uh, um oh yeah, yeah there's one more thing just when you're cleaning a Actually, no, there isn't one more thing. I completely forgot. But what was it about to do? Anyways, um, well, so, just before you choose, just think about these things. And, yeah, um, see you all next time. Bye!